Jumbo Jumbo Games. Hello everyone, welcome back to Jumbo Jumbo Games. Oh, today is such a nice day for me, I'll tell you all about it. First of all, I finally made it to this level after such a long time. And another thing is that I made it here with 10 different lives, ready to go, so really happy about that. And it was really hard, I'm telling you, I spent like another <clears throat> 10 tries on that one level that causes me lots of trouble. And then I finally made it back, so I'm here making video. It was just great, I'm just, just really happy about it. I kind of was really frustrated yesterday and I was trying to do this. But it just didn't happen, because I couldn't beat that level, and I didn't even end up even posting a video yesterday because of that. I was like, forget it. But today, everything is going right. Everything is going great for me. Not just this, but other things in my life, like, got, oh... Uh, well, whatever, I'll continue. I got a job interview coming up on Thursday, so I'm really happy about that. They just called me today. And that's great, it's through my friend, uh, but he's, yeah, he told me about it, it's his old job, and I'm just really happy about that. Another thing he said, <clears throat> is that I've been, I, f I found that uh, Weezer, my, one of my favorite bands, they released a secret album between the Blue Album and Pinkerton, it's called Songs from songs from the black hole or something like that anyway I've been listening to it all morning and it's really good I don't know why they decided not to release it I mean there's a few songs I don't like but anyway it's way better than what they've been doing for a long time like their stuff these days is okay I suppose I'm not saying it's bad but their old stuff is really like required listening I think if you never listen to Weezer if you never listen to the Blue Album if you never listen to Pinkerton and you know, some other other stuff's really great, but those two albums, man, you got to check them out if you never have. And also look for their album that comes between it, that they didn't release. It's uh, like a rock opera, but and it's like science fiction rock opera that they made. Pretty crazy, and anyway, I'm really happy about that. And on top of that, let's see what, there was another thing. Oh yeah, well also I've been making music again, and I'm happy about the creative juices, you know what I'm saying? Just was not making much for a long time, but got some inspirations within the past couple days. And I'm really happy about that as well. It's just one of those days, you know, where everything is just going right. And you don't know why, You, I don't even feel like I deserve it. But... It's one of those great days in life when you just know everything's going good. And here I am playing Donkey Kong Country, making video for YouTube, and it's great for me to do that every once in a while. I'm happy that this is coming through, and then I got 10 lives and that I won't have much of a problem finishing this up this time. So anyway, that's the update about my life, if you don't know. Come on, donkey, you're so slow. He really is quite slow. It's, be it's better not hit me in the back. Yeah, I'm feeling a lot better about this... ...this level. Now that I've got so many lives, I don't really... ...have much to think about other than that. <coughs> and, and I'm almost at the end, there we go. That's another one done. Thanks, everybody. I don't care about him. This lights, I hope this is not too dark when you guys try to watch this. I hope that the light stays good. I mean, I know you can see where the light is, but sometimes I watch videos on YouTube and people haven't... They haven't, uh, you know, they haven't put up enough uh, lighting, even when they, especially in playthroughs, I've seen people do that. And I don't want to be one of those people, you know what I'm saying? So anyway, hopefully this looks good. If it's not, I'll probably brighten it up anyway. Yeah, oh, okay, that I think is the, maybe the same spot. Did I get... 
I got the checkpoint, so it wasn't the same spot. That's good. I like that sound effect it make. And I'm not going to imitate it because that would be silly. Looks like I'm almost to the end of this level. This is where I died, so I gotta take my time with it. I like the donkey can kill the bigger guys. It really is quite nice. There we go! There was no G. For some reason they just never showed a G, but does matter. Let's go save it up. And let's finish off this world, because I hate this world. I hate it, and I want it to be done, so let's do it. Uh, that's funky, I don't care. It looks like maybe one more and then the boss. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. I mean, all the stuff I talk about at the beginning of this episode is not really related to anything in the video games, but I don't care. I like talking about it. So, you know, sometimes I'm gonna talk about stuff that's not even video games. I'm just gonna talk about it. And you're gonna enjoy it. And I think actually something I thought about that I'd like to do on this channel is maybe put up some links to some of the music that I make. So that if any of you are interested in hearing what the kind of music I like to make, you can help yourself to something like that. And I'll be I'll be so happy to to hear that more people are listening and enjoying it. But I make all sorts of different kinds of music. And so it's not going to appeal to everybody. Right now I'm working on a doom metal album. And also ambient atmospheric type album. And I'm pretty excited about both of them. But in the past I've made all sorts of different stuff. Made electronic music with beats, you know. And I make just general singer-songwriter type music sometimes. And sometimes they make... Oh, I made... Um, another metal album, sludge metal album, and a dark, dark ambient type album. So I get all over the place and nobody seems to appreciate everything I do, but people will say, oh I like this part, but I don't like this other crap that you did. But then some people will like the other crap, and they don't like the crap that other people like, so... Anyway, my fan base is very small, but at the same time, it's very eclectic, and I like that about it. So, anyway, I'll put it up maybe on this video. If you want to, I'll put it in the description. I'll put like links to all the different stuff I do. So if you have, if you want to check it out, just check out the description there and have a listen. If you like, if you like metal music, I I would suggest go to the one that is SKX, which is the project that I do. And if you can get that reference, I'll give you something, maybe. It's a... Uh, yeah, I won't tell you, I'll maybe tell you in the next episode or something like that. But the SKX, if that, that's a reference about a video game. Anyways, that's the one where I make much darker stuff. Lots of metal and whatever that, like, whatever demons I want to express go in that music. Then I got another one called the Arachnophobia Kids, which is more electronic music. So I think there's about three albums there, different styles though. One's more like, you know, just electronic, one's got some like lo-fi beats and stuff. And here we go, the boss. And the other project is called Adam Something. And that, I guess, is a revealing of my first name. If you didn't know, well, I didn't think I ever said anything about that so but that's that's my name Adam something no well not my last name but I mean my first name is Adam and my last name is not something but that's the name of the project that I work on oh jeez I did it good and that's more like singer songwriter stuff so if you like you know whatever that kind of stuff then give that a shot and that's gonna be it for this episode of Jumbo Jambo Games. Check out my music if you want to. And uh, come on back for the next episode after this one. Goodbye, my friends.